2015 was a difficult year for logistic providers. Global revenue declined 5%, and the most difficult situation was in Europe. Uh, Western Europe declined 13%, Eastern Europe dipped 21%, and then the core of it was slowing manufacturing sector, global manufacturing sector, and um, continuously slowing uh, retail and wholesale sector. However, we do believe that um, things are going to turn for the better and uh, accelerating Asian Pacific economies, recovering um, manufacturing in Western Europe, all of this will add up and we, we think that uh, the revenues of the log global logistics market is going to turn for the positive growth of the coming 10 years. There's a wholesale and retail and construction industries are the two key clients of the logistics providers globally. Uh, each of them generates over 15% of all revenues. Unfortunately, wholesale and retail will stay on a slower growth forecast over the coming 10 years. Um, the reasons for that will remain similar to those that uh, is reflecting on it now. Um, rise in e-commerce, uh, rise in discount stores, uh, complication of supply chains. All of it is reflected not only on retail providers, but also on um, uh, logistics companies. The construction industry, on the other hand, is... Um, going to perform uh, much better in the coming 10 years. It will grow over 7% and the uh, main growth markets will remain in Asia, China, Indonesia, India. Um, there, there will be some challenges for the logistics providers as well because with growing urbanization trends, um, companies have to increasingly operate delivering supplies to construction sites that are uh, based in highly urbanized areas, in tight space and um, a number of restrictions that reflect on them. Uh, but growing construction industry will also reflect, will kind of stay in the chain effect on the manufacturing industry that relate to that. And if we turn to manufacturing, we see that um, cement, stone, and ceramic industry is um, one of the largest uh, manufacturing industry that is spending on and will continue spending a lot on the logistics providers in the future. And we think that's going to grow 9% over the coming 10 years and will add up to the recovery of the logistics market. Growth will also, also come from uh, metals, uh, non ferrous metals, from textiles, and of course from one of the most lucrative manufacturing industry, uh, electronic components that is on the rise and will continue to be on the rise. And these industries will be growing from 8 to 10 percent over the coming 10 years. So to wrap up, uh, even though the logistics companies will continue to be affected uh, by the slower year in uh, wholesale and retail sector, uh, industries like construction, like cement, stone, and ceramics like uh, textiles and um, electronic components will be the drivers uh, of the logistics uh, market in the future that will be growing, we believe, by 6% over the coming 10 years.